Ghana's ruling NPP party on Saturday elected the country's vice president Mahamudu Baumir as their candidate for the 2024 presidential ballot, according to the results from primaries released by the Electoral Commission. Ghana is undergoing its worst economic crisis in years, which will be a major electoral issue next year when President Nana Akuf Ado steps down after two terms and an agreement for a US dollar three billion loan from the International Monetary Fund. According to the final results, Baumir won 61.4% of the votes for Kennedy Ohene Ajapong won 37.4 percent. Baumir, a former deputy central bank governor, had been widely touted by policers to win the new Patriotic Party NPP candidacy. He will face opposition National Democratic Congress candidate ex-president John Dramani Mahamar at the end of the next year. Baumir had already won the first round of NPP voting and as the first Muslim candidate to lead the ethnic Akan and Southern dominated party, he had positioned himself to bridge some of Ghana's regional decision divisions. A major cocoa and gold producer, Ghana also has oil and gas reserves, but its debt, its, debt, its debt load has expanded and like other sub-Saharan African nations, it has struggled with economic fallout from the global pandemic and the Russia-Ukraine war. Ghana signed the deal with the IMF last year as the country sought to shore up the public finances and better manage growing debt and its local currency. It recently reached agreement on the terms for a second payment of US dollar 600 million out of the US dollar 3 billion credit deal. But the economic situation is complicated. Several hundred opposition po protesters rallied in Ghana's capital Accra last month to denounce the economic crisis, blaming it on the central bank governor's policies. President Akuf Ado has led the country since 2017 and will step down after serving the town the two terms allowed by the constitution. Opposition candidate Mahama lost to Akuf Ado in the 2016 and 2020 elections.